Laszlo. My daddy used to whoop the tar out of me. He once hit me so hard, my spleen oh, fell out of my ear. Didn't do me no harm. Look at me now, I'm the best pest control guy in these sports. I've killed more rats, roaches, vermin than you can imagine, and I love it. This is such a great country. I wouldn't be where I am today if my daddy hadn't beat me that <laughs> What are you talking about? Man, I'm starting to believe that guy about the fluoride in the drinking water. Listen, if there's... We're at war. The Triads have a fish factory as a front. Most of their business goes down at the fish market in Chinatown. The laundry still owes us protection. They reckon the Triads are protecting them now, so I say we exact a fitting punishment. Take those boys over and whack the Triad warlords. Hell, if you get a chance, pop some of their soldiers, too. wrestling? viewers aware the first international puppetry festival is next month at the fairgrounds bro if you're interested in becoming a puppet master or a ventriloquist you should definitely come down dude it's gonna be totally killer <laughs> i wasn't aware that there was much demand for puppet shows these days. Oh, man. Oh, man. Hello, Petunia the Pinky, meet Barry the Thumb. String puppets, glove puppets, dude, it's gonna rock. <laughs> okay, thanks. Hope to see you there, Laszlo. Hey, by the way, can you give me that guy Fernando's number? Nah, I'm sorry. Fernando hasn't paid his bill to our ad sales department. But here's someone who has, and they paid us in stacks of old groats and gold guineas. We'll be back after this. <laughs> Do you live in the boring suburbs but dream of living in a low... Noble stallion, do you eat microwave dinners? All the while wishing you were roasting a suckling pig at a pagan banquet. Is your next ideal home improvement a boat? Well, get ready, Liberty City. This weekend and every weekend at Liberty City Park, it's the Medieval Millennium Fair. Our... Oh, 
Okay, I've had enough of this shit. We're gonna finish the triads in Liberty once and for all. Eight Ball's rigged a dust cart with a bomb. It's on a timer, so if you mess up, there'll be no evidence. Go and pick up the dust cart. Careful. Eight Ball says it's real sensitive, and the slightest bump could set that thing off. Their fish factory will open its gates for a dust cart, so you can drive right in. Park up between the gas canisters and get the hell out of there. I want it to rain mackerel. We're talking real biblical here. Nothing low budget. Take a call. Who's on the line? Crows. What about them? Crows. What are you talking about? Laszlo. Crows. Crows, Laszlo. I hate them. I Why don't you like clones? I just hate them. They're so constricting. I mean, there's a line where clothes, and the line is the king of the jungle. So why can't I, a humble citizen, go and... Naked, I'm gonna die naked. I'm going to live naked. So there, there's nothing wrong with being naked. It's so invigorating seeing the hot leather of a chair or the cool wind from the north on your naked body. I, I, I'm gonna have to cut you off. Don't you believe in free speech? Free expression? No, of course you don't. All you believe in is free drinks. I'm naked and there's not a damn thing you can do about it. I'm naked and I feel so good. Well, what about winter? What do you mean? You know, I mean, what about winter? When the wind blows and it's really cold, I mean, you prance about like a ninny waiting for your privates to go blue? I was born naked, I'm gonna die naked. <laughs> and all shriveled up by the sound of things. Winter was invented by clothing companies. Clothes are unnecessary. They're ugly. Have you ever cooked in the nude? No, uh, look, is this leading anywhere? Because, I mean, we've got a lot of other people waiting to talk about real things here. Nudity is real. Open your eyes, take off your pants, come on. Come on, Laszlo, you should be a figurehead for Liberty City Naturists. We have more members now for the first time since 1977. Nudity is back. A lot of people are into nudity and really understand the spiritual side. What? I'm hanging out with loads of naked chicks? I mean, I see the fun in it, but I just think clothes have distinct advantages, like like not accidentally cooking yourself or, or when... No, I'm police. I'm gonna get you. 